Hey, what's going on everyone? Stack in the South, coming at you with another brand new video. It is Thursday afternoon. I just got home from work and the drive home was an absolute nightmare. I just don't understand how traffic can get so messed up so often. And there's only so many ways that I can take to get to my house. And I try all of them. But uh, today was especially nightmarish. But anyway, my boy and I, we made it home um, and we're just waiting and hanging out for uh, my fiance to get home. But um, yeah, I got a mail call, so I thought I'd do a little video. I know you guys, I haven't been buying much, but I did win something at an auction um, probably about a month ago now. Um, I think it's just a little 10th ounce bar, but that's okay. Um, and I also, of course, won want something. So we're gonna look at both of the items that I got. But uh, you know, I'm, 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 I'm excited. I haven't been getting much in my hand lately. So, you know, I did a video the other day um, about kind of like stacking withdrawals. And, and I think those are real. Uh, I miss it. You know, I haven't been, I almost went to the coin store today just because of let them know I'm still alive and I haven't dropped off the face of the earth. Um, you know, I still might drop by. Um, I'm sure there'll probably be something I couldn't live without. That's part of the reason why I don't want to go in there. But, uh, it, it's hard not to keep buying metals. Uh, something I've learned I enjoy very much. So this taking this break has been difficult. Like y'all know, I've cheated a couple times and bought a couple things in between here and there. I.e. that, and I don't know. And I think that one too, maybe. Um, but other than that, I've been pretty good, right? Um, but I did win something, and I went ahead and uh, won another coin from the auction. So uh, I won't waste too much of y'all's time. So let's get started. I already have the thing cut open, so before I just want to make sure there's nothing crazy. It's going to... Oh! <laughs> Boy, it's like Halloween all over again. Check that out. I got some candy. All right, let's start with the candy. Laffy Taffy, Sour Apple, let's hope it's not vintage, oh Sweet Tarts, I love these things, Sweet Tarts, one of my favorites, uh, what is that, I don't even know what this is, oh well, something great, uh, and I will eat it. Along with the uh, 500 pounds of candy we have. Oh, now and laters, I guess. Eh. Now and later. I'll eat one now and one later. All right, man. Thanks for the candy. Um, all right. Just a little bit of a, a little receipt. Um, nothing biggie. And then something to stiffen up the package. All right. So let's get to it. Let's get on the ball. All right, so here, let's turn that over. Let's take it out of there. That's what we should do. Nothing more than I hate than these little flips. I hate those. Absolutely hate those. All right, let's see if I can do this. So it, it's pretty cool. Little scorpion, it's like a $1. That's hard to read. I messed up my fingers are when I get them too close to the, uh, the screen. But yeah, there it is. I won. Woo! -hoo! I'm a wiener. I can't focus in on that. Uh, sorry, y'all. Uh, but anyway, woo! Another one. Before I lose it, I'll put it back in the flip. All right. That's. I think I have two ten out tenth ounce bars now. And of course, I had couldn't go through. Um, so I won that. So I ended up getting free shipping. And thankfully, I won another coin. I've been trying to hit up a couple of his auctions between the time I won that one and now to try and get, you know, something else on free shipping. But yeah, it just didn't happen. But uh, Historic Metals. I don't know if you guys know who he is. Um, he's been running auctions for a little while now. Uh, it's a good channel. Um, he's definitely... Um, Gaining some steam 
Um, I've been watching his since he first started, and uh, you know, he's getting a good amount of people, and uh, the guy has quite the selection of stuff. Now, if you're looking for vintage rounds and bars, uh, I don't think you're going to find those. Um, but he does have a lot of awesome bullion, gold. He's even got some platinum. Uh, he just has quite the great selection. A lot of times, if you just speak up and say, hey, if you're looking for something in particular, it's a good chance he has it, and he'll show it to you. Um, so give him a shot. Uh, check out his, um, his auctions. I try to check him out every week. You know, even if I'm just hanging out, not necessarily buying something, I just put on the background, kind of listen and, you know, look around. And I, I like to, you know, say hi to all the, the folks that show up. Um, and I also did a, a live last night with long lived coins. That was fun. I don't know if y'all saw that one. Um, that was fun. I was there for about an hour and 15 minutes. I, I had to cut out a little early. I was having a running late yesterday, like crazy. Um, but it was fun. Uh, I think we're going to do it again at some point here and probably in the near future. And if you haven't checked out Long Live Coins, he's another one of my channels I really like. Uh, I did a one of my community notes where I find somebody in the community that's starting out that I think has a cool channel, a cool subject, and uh, is going to go places. And I kind of do a community notes of channels that I think you need to take note of. And so Long Live Coins, man, he's a good guy. It was fun. He also has some awesome stuff that is you know, upwards of thousands of years old. It's, it's crazy. Um, but anyway... Check them out. Long live coins and historic medals. Y'all know what to do. And here is my winning. Or my. I didn't win this one. I paid for it, but. You know. 1982. All right. That's a nice. Y'all know how I feel about Libertads. You know, if you can get them in the $30 range, I, I jump. I try to jump on those. Um, so, yeah. 82. I'm um, getting closer to my stack being filled up. You know, I still have about 17 in my of the more modern ones, and now this makes number five in my tube. Yep. I love them. Let's look at these. All right. It's a brand new one. 82. Eighty-four. Yep, pretty. Another eighty-four. And then, let's see what we here we got here. Eighty-three. And I believe this one's probably the eighty-five. I have an eighty-five in there too. Yep, there it is. Eighty-five. So I'm well on my way. I'm about one quarter of the way now to having 20 in a tube. Um, and I just use this one. This is a half dollar one from the local coin store. It's a little loose on these ones, but I couldn't really find anything else that fit these ones a little snugly. So they rattle around in there a little bit. Um, but you know, keeps, keeps everything. Independencia e Liberty. Or, I don't know. Libertad. Okay. And of course, 17 in this one. I mean, these are in a, an American Silver Eagle tube, but they gave it to me and they fit, so I use it. 17 of these bad boys in there. Yep. All right. I think that's good on the silver part, right? I'm not going to keep you all here for one, two little pieces. Um, but what I am going to do is open up one of these Hot Wheels real quick because I've been sitting on these things for a hot minute. And, uh, oh yeah, stack that gold. Here's the one I was telling you about uh, in that comment. The one with sitting on the, the post with the barbed wire. Stack that gold, I think this is one of my favorites uh, for sure. All right, so I got a whole lot of Hot Wheels that... um need an opening you know my fiance just realized that i've taken over I'm starting to take over a third shelf the other day eh. that was pretty funny <laughs> i told her i would move them somewhere else i said that the problem is i've been opening them you know from um, these videos so 
it is what it is. Anyway, so without further ado, I'm not going to waste a whole lot of time because I'm already at 10 minutes. It's amazing. 94 Audi Avant RS2. You know, I got to love me some rally cars. Um, there's a Forza themed Forza Speedo game on Xbox. Uh, it's pretty good. Pretty good racer if you're into those. Um, all right. Must around anymore. This one I actually found the other day at Walmart. I'm pretty stoked. I've been finding some decent cars lately, uh, so I have to pick up a couple here and there. But I have definitely come back. You know, like Brembo, Pirelli, Borla, Bilstein, Audi Quattro, Forza number 23. I don't. I'm not a huge fan of Audi. Um, I do like their rally stuff. I do like Audi, but uh, I'm not a huge fan, but I do love their um, their rally vehicles. Yeah, this one's pretty cool. Uh, I don't think this is based off any real cars. I don't know. Um, I believe this is just basically from the video game. But uh, anyway, there it is. That's my latest pickup on the uh, the cars. All right, guys, I'm out.